What's up everybody, it's Giuseppe here. I'm in the gym, I'm gonna be commenting over my leg workout. Now, I don't have any leg workouts on my channel, and it's not that I skip leg day, it's just that I happen to never record it. So, beginning off with the workout, we did some squats, me and my friend Julian, and what we did was a five by five. Well, I did a five by five, and I PR'd with doing 225 for five reps. Um, before I used to do my five by fives with 205 pounds, so now I guess I got a 20 pound increase. And I racked that weight, and here goes Julian. Um, Julian is actually gonna PR in this set right here. He has 315 pounds on the bar, and he only weighs about 150 pounds. So, 150 pound person is squatting 315 pounds. This guy is a beast. Um, I've always known him to be like the strongest guy out of my little workout group at the gym. But um, after our squats, we moved on some hamstring curls because you cannot neglect those hamstrings. I know I did for well, like the first five months of my training. Uh, I just, you know, I never thought about it. Hamstrings are behind me. I didn't think I really needed to train them. Um, but then once I started trying on my speedo for swim season, I was like, damn, I have no hamstrings. So I started doing a bunch of hamstring exercises because um, I did six sets here um, in this exercise. And I've always been doing many sets for my hamstrings, so I'm just trying to bring it up. I noticed that my leg did get a lot bigger once I put a more emphasis on it, just because they were lacking so much. But after our hamstrings, um, we moved on to some leg press. And um, I don't do a lot of range of motion on this. You can see I'm not going down that far. That's just because I really like to flex my, um, I really like to flex my legs the whole time, so I get like a better pump. But after we did our set with that, we moved on and did a superset of calf press. Yeah, but you never heard of that calf press. You've heard of uh, calf raises, calf extensions, but never calf press. And then we triple setted that. Yes, triple set with standing body weight calf raises. So we were beating up our calves. And then here goes Julian doing a set. And I think he hurt his knee. His knee keeps hurting. Like he'll switch from the right leg to the left leg and back and forth. So. I don't know what's going on with that, but here he goes with his calf raises. And here we go. Now we're going to be doing our seated calf raises. So here we go. Um, with For my positioning on my calves, I just do a traditional nice and straight. Try to poke my toes like a ballerina. Um, I feel like this works best for me just because I can feel my calves stretching. But, but Julian likes to have different variations in his calves. So sometimes he'll have a regular stance and then other times he will have them far apart. Like right now you just saw him position them further apart. Now he likes to do this. Um, he has a better stretch and a better pump in his calves. So if you guys are interested in trying something new, maybe try your positioning. But here's a current update on my legs. As you can see, they're pretty big. I mean, they're average, nothing amazing, but they're pretty cut. So yeah, making some progress. And anyways, guys, if you have any comments or suggestions, leave them in the comment section below. I'll be more than happy to respond to you guys and make videos on whatever you want. So Zeppi signing out. See you in the next one.